I can't believe all the tests we're getting. Is it bad in the academic program too? Definitely. We had a French test this morning, we have a science test next class, and we have a math test this afternoon. Eric and I are thinking of transferring this back to right junior right. high. Oh, no, anything but that. <laughs> Schedule for midterm exams. Uh, yeah, we'll see you. Yeah, we're gonna get Bye. 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 Still chasing wheels, I see. Yes. I'm gonna get him too. Here, look at this. Let's see. Okay, right here. How to get him to see you is more than just a friend. I'm tired of being just friends. It's time he saw me as an object of desire. Some of these articles are pretty dumb. No, this one's brilliant. I already read it. It says I should throw a party. Well, how is a party gonna help you? Well, it's amazing what low lights and hot music can do. Oh, it's gonna no. work, Aaron, but trust me. No. Wake up in the morning, gotta shake the feeling. I gotta face the day of school. Who wants to be afraid of? I can ask a question. I may be. All right, I'm sorry, time is up. Please put your pens down. Make sure your name is on your paper. That was tough. Not so? I finished early, so I started writing a guest list. Oh, yeah? Yeah. See? Heather, do you really think having a party is going to make girls like you? Oh, come on. Why not? Don't be so negative. You know, you've had boyfriends. Don't remind me. I just don't want to see you do anything dumb. I won't do anything dumb. So are you going to help me or not? OK. <laughs> All right, then. OK. First, we call Mom to see if we can even have this party. I did so That's much fun work last night. I know I have time for nothing else but home. Mm -hmm. Social life is <laughs> Can you guys believe all of these tests? I know. It's like a labor camp. <laughs> Kathleen. Kathleen, I... She's busy. Are you and Scott having a fight? They broke up. Kathleen's back in the have-not club like us. <laughs> have-not club? We have not decent clothes. We have not popularity. We have not hickeys. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like me. Can I join? Of course. It's not really a club, more of a joke. The purpose of membership is to get out. <laughs> I'll never get out. I'm not allowed to have a boyfriend. I wouldn't worry. There's no decent guys at this school anyway. Yeah, <laughs> where are all the perfect guys? <laughs> What's your idea of a perfect guy? Considerate, tall, good-looking, rich. <gasps> Mine would be romantic, gorgeous, intelligent, and sexy. I'm not asking for a lot. <laughs> <laughs> My perfect man's a doctor who falls madly in love with me and dedicates the rest of his life to finding a cure for my disease. Heather, there he is. History. Here goes nothing. Come on. Hi, guys. Hey, hi. Um, Eric and I are having a party tomorrow. You guys are invited. Right on. Okay. Okay, come to our place anytime after six. Sure. What's the occasion? Nothing special. Bye. Bye. Do you have to make it so obvious? I'm sure I know this. 
had to relax. He didn't figure anything out. I think Heather likes you. So, I like her too. No, I mean she really likes you. No way, we're just friends. Hi, Luz. Hi. Hey, Luz, guess what? We're having a party tomorrow. <laughs> Great. Look, would it be OK if I invited Clutch? <laughs> oh, well, sure. Are the two lovebirds getting back together? <laughs> Maybe. We'll see. <laughs> Oh, while you guys are here, can you sign this card? It's for LD. I'll take it to her tonight. Sure. I thought she'd be out of hospital by now. So did everybody. They're doing about a billion tests on her. You know how she hates hospitals. And she still doesn't know what's wrong. No. She's really scared. I've ever written. I know. I don't even want to talk about it. I mean, what were those questions he gave us? I didn't understand anything. Are you guys as fed up with midterms as I am? Yes. <laughs> I think we need an official meeting with the Had Not Club. Do you like going for donuts? Sure. Yeah. Maya, do you want to come for donuts with us? I can't. My mom picks me up at a quarter to four. I could go Monday and tell her to come later. Sure, why not? Let's make it Monday. Great. I gotta go down the ramp. You know, they should have a ramp at both ends of the school. It's stupid that you have to go all the way to one end of the building and then all the way back. At least there is a ramp. Not all buildings are so accessible. See you Monday. See ya. Planning three days ahead just to go for donuts? Not exactly spontaneous. Would Mr. Owen please buzz the office? So, you guys want to go to a movie tomorrow? Yeah. Sure, why not? The have-nots on the track. <laughs> what do you want to see? Um, I hear Queen in Exile is supposed to be excellent. Really mushy. <laughs> I really want to see that. What's the name of that actress in it? It's on at the Mount Royal. It's easy to get to. You know, we should invite Maya. But how will she get there? She can't take a street costume. And besides, there's about a million steps in the Mount Royal. It's awful how they don't make all buildings accessible. I think she'd understand if we don't invite her. I don't know. We don't have to do everything together. Kathleen, can I speak to you for a second, please? Go ahead, I'll catch up. OK. Look, I'm really sorry. My temper, it was just everything at home, you know. I didn't mean to hurt you. It'll never, ever happen again. Please, I need you. Sorry. I brought this for you. Everybody signed it. <laughs> Thanks. How's it going? Fine. How are the tests? I find out tomorrow. It'll be fine. You look great. I look awful. Thanks anyway. I just wish I didn't feel so crummy all the time. You'll get better soon. I know you will. Oh, the twins are having a party tomorrow. Too bad you're not going to be there. Oh, say hi to everyone for me. I will. Especially Wheels. <laughs> Look, why don't I drop by tomorrow? You know, before the party. Sure. I just hope I know by then. I've done so many tests. One, 
They stuck a needle in my hip bone. Ow. I wish they'd talk to me. They smile a lot. They never tell me anything. Come on, LD. This will all be over really soon. I brought tons of tissue in case I cry. Oh, please don't. I hate it when people cry at movies. I can't help it. Besides, crying's good for you. You know, it's too bad Maya couldn't come. Melanie, we all think it's too bad she couldn't come. But she just couldn't. Stop talking about it. It'll come out in video soon. She can see it then. I owe you a ticket, Melanie. I'll pay the fare. Okay. I'm paying for both of us. Okay, it says here, make sure to touch his hair. You're gonna touch his hair? Yeah, it says here that guys love it when you touch their hair. Heather, come on. People are gonna be here any minute. Okay, what you want me to do? We can move that table over there, okay? Okay. Okay, you have to help me. If you see us dancing and it's a fast song, change the music quick, okay? And then after we've danced a bit, I'll say it's hot. We'll go outside, and then because it's cold out there, I'll snuggle up to him and... Heather, stop. Relax. Don't plan so much. Let Mother Nature take its course. Forget nature. I am not missing my big opportunity. Excuse me. Is this Dr. Foley's office? Yes. Thank you. Dr. Sidney Gibson, do I see you? Ta-da! What do you think of my new dress? What's wrong? I'm trying to be brave for my dad and everything. Why do you have to be brave? They told me. I have leukemia. Isn't, isn't that like cancer? It is cancer. My mom died from cancer. I have to start chemotherapy tomorrow. I'm gonna lose all my hair. It'll grow back. They say it will. LD, I know you. You're strong. You can beat this. Lucy, nice to see you. Hi. Um, I better get going. Lucy, don't tell anyone, okay? Not yet. Lower. Oh, I love this 
song. Let's dance. Come on, Simon. You want to dance? Yeah. Dance? Sure. Spilling us with fear. We stumble in a fit too deep. This time we go. It's hot in here. Yeah, it is. Um, you wanna go outside? Yeah, okay. It's sure hot in there. Yeah, especially with so many people. It's nice up here, though. Yeah, it is. You wanna go sit? Sure. What? Do I have, do I have something um, in my hair? Uh, but it's gone now. Thanks. Oh, are you cold? Look at all the stars. They're gorgeous. Yeah, they are. Do you have any constellations? No, just the Big Dipper. Isn't that it? Over there? Oh, yeah. Um, there's Cassiopeia right there. I like the W. You're pretty good at astrology. Astronomy. Erica's astrology. She'd stay upstairs. Yeah, well, her curiosity kind of got the better of her. But you better come inside. Sorry. Sorry. Well, that's okay. I'd better be getting home anyway. Call you tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye. trust the people around here. You've also told me that you're going to get medication and it's going to uh, make Hi. you sick. Is the party over already? I decided not to go. You two talk. I'll, uh, I'll go downstairs for some coffee. 
Either of you want something? No, thanks. I'll be back soon, honey. I brought you a friend. Thanks. I also got some magazines. I thought maybe we could look through them, pick out clothes or something. Sure. They have the most expensive clothes in this. That's nice, I like that. Luce, thanks for coming back. Yeah. Yeah, it's getting hot in there. Uh, not as hot as it was out here, though. <laughs> want to go? Uh, not really. This is some party. Well, I really want to get out of here. If you want to stay, that's fine. No, no. Listen, I'll come with you. So, everybody knows. Yeah. Yeah. Great. I didn't mean to. It just happened. Desperately, he tried to fight her off. But when Heather keeps a guy pinned to the couch, he stays pinned. Man, this is serious. Well, there's nothing wrong with making out. But you like her, right? Yeah, but not like as a girlfriend. And I said I'd call her, but I don't really want to. I don't know what to say. Apologize to her. Oh, get real. You don't tell someone you don't really like them after you fooled around. Fabulous party. It was. I can't believe we ran out of food. I don't think anyone really noticed. I think I'm in love. Seriously, Heather, you are really going at it. Yeah, I know. You should be careful. Remember what happened to me. Erica, we are the same age. I think I can take care of myself. That's what I say. What do you suppose happened to Lucy? I don't know. Maybe I should give her a call. No, don't pick up the phone. Will said he'd call, so I kind of want to keep the line free. Okay, thanks. That was such an excellent movie. I know. I didn't stop crying for hours after I got home. Oh, my liege, thou art balm in my exile. <laughs> Stand back, you swine. Take your grimy paws off the woman I love. That sounds like Queen in Exile. Have you guys seen it? Well, we wanted to ask you to come, but we were taking the streetcar, and there's about a million steps in the Mount Royal. Sorry. You guys don't want me to go to the movies with you, fine. But don't assume I can't go. My mom would have driven me. She would have driven all of us. You're right. I can't get into the Mount Royal. But I can get into the Princess, the Cumberland, and a whole bunch of others. There's a lot of things I can't do. But there's also a lot of things I can do. I don't need patronizing from a bunch of hypocrites who talk about handicapped accessibilities and then have the nerve to decide for me what I can and can't do. Maya. Good Maya. Wait. Hot off the I'm sorry. Pick up your wand. I'm sure he has a perfectly good reason for not calling. He was probably away this weekend. It wasn't a win. Aw, oh, now he didn't say when he'd call. See him at school anyway. I don't want to see him now. I'm really embarrassed. Hi. Hi.
creep. What a creep! I guess it was what I wanted. I mean, that was the point of the whole party. I still think he's a creep. He didn't call her. No. So what are you gonna do, just not talk to her for the rest of the year? Anyway, there's still plenty of fish in the sea, right? Right. It's too bad, though. We used to be friends. Now we're not.